Everyone's different and ultimately it is the tra trader's responsibility to find out what works for him. So I'm not suggesting any rules to anybody. I am pointing out maybe the pros and cons of different approaches. Paper trading will take you so far. It will, should humble you uh, without losing money. It will, should show you the scale of the problem that you're up against. It will not replicate the psychological pressures of real trading. And that, so it'll take you thus far, no further. And then you have to start gambling with money. The crux that outsiders, which are people not working for, for banks and brokerages, houses and hedge funds and so on, the crux of their problem is learning at their own expense. When you must remember professionals have learned their business at someone else's expense. And that's a very big difference. And so it's a very heavy burden that outsiders have to bear. You might be a successful paper trader, uh, but in the end, trading is a percentage game, not uh, hitting sixes or, or uh, hitting them out of the ground. If you're successful for a while, then there will be a time when you're unsuccessful. It will not replicate the psychological pressures of losing your own money.